Dang, man, Capcom, you kind of messed up on these guidelines recently. Um, listen, if you don't know what I'm talking about, basically Capcom released a, a new um, guideline list for uh, how they want their content to be published. Um, the main thing that I have with this right now, I'm all aboard the whole train of like uh, using content and selling it off as your own being prohibited and all that types of stuff. I'm like, I'm totally down with that. It's just that when we get to the third segment of this article, which I'll put down in the description, by the way, uh, Nintendo, no, Capcom, Capcom is, um, deciding that any third party thing like mods, hacking, stuff that helps you like play online with your friends and whatnot, like having that stuff or uploading it is like strictly prohibited um to upload on youtube and whatnot and dude this means a lot because i used to see mods about street fighter 5 all the time and it's crazy because now capcom's doing this it's it's dumb man in the sense and the only reason why i find it dumb is because of the moments where people use it for the sheer fun of enjoying the game that way I can argue that same thing for Smash Brothers and for, you know, with the whole slippy thing. It sucks that Capcom's doing it now. Um, there's also some other weird guidelines in there, like how you can't play a game like Mega Man, which is like a game for everyone, and like criticize it with slurs and whatnot. That's also prohibited. And when it comes to books, man, physical publications, digital publications, you, you, you can't even like... You can't even, like, upload. Like, that stuff prohibited, too. It's crazy. Um, anyways, dude, what do, you, what, do you, what do you think about this stuff? The mod community is going to get seriously hurt by this. And this video is two minutes long, so I gotta go. Peace out.